sharp knife. Just make any type of a little incision there. That's not important of how you do it, where you do it, but it's just an access point so you can put a pair of scissors in. What we're going to do is to cut off the neck of the bottle and cut off of the base of the bottle, and then the material that's left will be uh, uh, the basis for our face shield. So I'm going to start cutting around here a bunch of small little cuts. Where I want to end up, you can see where there's a straight portion of the bottle and a curved portion, uh, the neck of the bottle. We want to end up with just a little bit of this curved portion left. So I uh, don't want to try to make the final cut on the first pass around, but I will uh, continue to make uh, small little increments of cutting as we go around here. Okay. Uh, smaller cuts allow you to make things a little bit smoother I found. The polycarbonate it is a tough material, it's cleanable. Uh, it's the same material that's used in safety uh, glasses, safety goggles in the work environment. Okay, that doesn't look so good, but now we can clean that up a little bit. got the neck off you can see there's a little bit of a curved portion left here next thing we're going to do is to slit the bottle up to the bottom we want to slit it along this uh, glue line here so just cut uh, straight through that up to the end maybe you can see there's a little mold mark here you want to cut past that mold mark because the next thing we're going to do is cut the bottom off and this has to be fairly straight on that mold mark. Okay, so we can start cutting there. If you can't really see it or you're not comfortable with cutting around that mark, uh, you know, just take some tape. You can wrap a loop of tape around your uh, bottle and then you have a nice guide. But we're just going to wing it here on this one. Uh, if you make a mistake and have to uh, recut it, your shield will be just a hair shoulder, but again, uh, dimensions here aren't critical. Okay, you want to get most of this off. There we go. Now we've got a piece of uh, very clear, strong, washable polycarbonate. Pretty cool. Okay, not a bad seam there. That looks pretty straight. The straighter it is, the better. Uh, before we install this uh, uh, shield, I'm going to round off just these corners a little bit. They're a little sharp. We'll just put a little radius on there. Uh, same thing on this one. This is the top edge that will be mounted in the hat. The bottom edge, which will float freely, I'm going to put a little bit bigger uh, radius on. That corner, we'll just round this off a little bit here. Okay, so there's our face shield. So, so. All right, now, with the baseball cap, a couple of things to point out here. It's just a regular uh, in the D uh, baseball cap, one of my favorites. Inside of the baseball caps, uh, there's a headband, and the ones, all the ones that I've seen, this headband is attached uh, to the brim on one side, and the uh, the rest of it here is kind of floating. So we want to take our shield, and we want to mount it inside the cap to that headband. Uh, we want to kind of uh, center it so this center of the shield lining up with the center of the brim here so we have equal mounts on either side. To uh, make it a little bit easier since I've got uh, two left hands, uh, I'm going to try these uh, binder clips here to see if that'll uh, give me like an additional hand here to help hold this. So we'll, uh, we'll put some of those on temporarily. OK, 
Okay, one in there, one there, maybe another one on the other side here. It's pretty important that you try to get the edge of the shield lined up with the free edge of the uh, headband. Okay, I think we'll uh, try that at the moment. Oh, that's not in the center, is it? Let's move all this stuff over. There we go. Slide that around. Put this one back on. There, that's a little better there. Okay, I'm going to straighten these up a little bit. So I want to take this edge again that I talked about, keep it lined up with the free edge or the top edge of the headband, and just take my handy little office stapler there, put in my first staple. Let's check it. That looks pretty good. Let's put in another one there. Maybe another one there. I'm going to move along the headband about a couple of inches. Double check that edge. There we go. Let's put in a couple more. Okay. Here you can see I've got some staples and the, uh, the polycarbonate lined up there. Looks like this other side has uh, come loose a little bit. Let's rewrap him around the edge there. Okay, bring that around here, bring that around here. Okay, let's get a staple in there. Two of those. Hopefully you're not making a video and you can take a little more time to align this. But uh, let's put a couple more near the corner here. Probably helps if I loosen up the strap. There we go. Just about done. Okay, so what do you think? Uh, I'm going to take my glasses off. It fits a little better. And uh, we'll go from there.